this is the juice that healed me. I created it myself, the concoction of it, and I healed myself from all the diseases I was suffering from. I had a heart attack when I was 21. I was uh, 264 pounds. I'm only 5'6". I had scar mm -hmm. tissue on my heart. My kidneys were failing. I had diabetes and erectile dysfunction. And this is what healed me. So I want to Peace, God. Today we're here to try the Brother Yaki's Detox Green Juice Recipe. Seven green apples, one celery stock with the leaves, a thumb of ginger. I'm gonna use a pinch of cilantro, a handful of parsley leaf, two cucumbers, and we're gonna peel the skin. One lemon, we're gonna leave the skin on, and then we'll add half a teaspoon of cayenne, super spicy. To clean my produce, I'm going to soak them in distilled water, sea salt, and key lime juice. If you want to use baking soda or apple cider vinegar or if you want to use both together and have them cancel each other out, that's fine. That's on you, but this is what I'm doing. It's a lot of ingredients for this recipe, so we're going to use the Kuvings Auto Tin Juicer, which is perfect for large batches of juice. If interested, I will leave a link in the description and the comment section where you can use the promo code BRANDON and save 10% off at checkout. And it does come with a smoothie and sorbet strainer. With a hopper style juicer, you want to load leafy greens on bottom and then top them with your heavier produce. We'll start with our handful of cilantro. Or sorry, this is a handful of parsley. And then a pinch of cilantro. I'm gonna load in my celery. Toss in my peeled thumb of ginger. Lime with the peel on. I think I could squeeze an apple in there. And that's all I'm gonna put in there for now. Somebody sent this recipe to me on Instagram, told me to check it out. I was like, let me go ahead and try this. Now, this will be my first time trying a couple of these ingredients. Uh, for one, I've never tried celery in a juice before. Never really dealt with parsley, and many will know I'm not really an apples fan because I could find a lot of pears that don't have that wax coating. Lemons, I'm more of a key lime person, but I'm excited to see what's up with this recipe. Now he did say he prepared this when he was on the verge of being obese. Uh, he had a lot of weight on him. Now in my life, I don't have any of those problems. I never had the problem with obesity, by the way. Even at the time when I was heavy into the set, the standard American diet, I've always been a set weight, wavering anywhere from 140 to 150 pounds. And that just is what it is. It's just the way my body works. But since adapting to a lifestyle heavily revolved around plants, I've gained more energy. As I get older and I continue to further improve on my routine, find better ways to improve on my health, I just continue to feel younger by the day. Last but not least, our teaspoon of cayenne mix. It's made around 50 ounces. Yaki estimated around 45 ounces, so it's not far off. First impression, let's go. First things first, the cayenne it has that kick in there to it. Now it's not crazy hot, but it does creep on you as you continue to drink it. I love the cayenne in this recipe. It's 
like 20 degrees outside and I feel okay right now. The celery is noticeable in the drink, but it's not overshadowing the other ingredients. Sometimes when you have too many ingredients, it comes off as each ingredient is fighting against each other, but I didn't feel that way drinking this. Today I'm currently on my weekly liquids fast. That's anywhere from 24 to 72 hours and I'm gonna continue to drink this for the remainder of that period and see how I feel. But first impressions, I really like this recipe. Again, I wanna give shout outs to Yaki Awaken. He's doing a great thing for the people. Definitely give this recipe a try and check out his video in case you've missed some of the benefits that these ingredients hold. Until next time, peace, God.